Hi, this is Patrick Hill from BMC Software. Today we're going to take a look at TrueSight Monitoring for Docker. With TrueSight Monitoring, you can find all the Docker container statuses in your Docker infrastructure, as well as monitor the performance of the containerized apps that you have running. So what is Docker? Docker is a relatively new technology that provides a way for developers to wrap up applications in or a piece of software that's part of their application delivery chain into a complete file system that guarantees that the app runs well independent or regardless of the environment. It's a very efficient way to deliver code that is, is not dependent on particular OSs. So a lot of folks want to know the difference between containerized technology versus virtualization. With virtual machines, when you have an application running, you have to, it's a dependent on a guest OS in a virtualized environment. So you will have, you know, your hypervisor or what you call a host operating system, and then provision these VMs. And each one of those is a particular OS. With Docker container strategy, you have the operating system, and then you have a Docker engine on top of that. And then each of the containers is not dependent on an OS. They can run independently in that containerized uh, environment, which makes it very desirable and efficient. So why TrueSight monitoring for Docker? Well, with the monitoring that TrueSight has, once you set up your connection, you know, your Docker settings, it automatically discovers the environment and can tell you when your resources become overloaded. So you can take action, for example, if, if a Dockerized environment needs more memory or CPU, you would be notified right away. So looking at the architecture, you can see that uh, we have our monetary server on one side and then we're making HTTP or HTTPS calls, REST IP calls to the Docker daemon that's usually running in the cloud, a public or private cloud. So we have remote monitoring so that you can quickly see the data that you need. Here's an example of how you configure it in the console. So you just need to have the username, password, port, and then if you're doing HTTPS, your certificate information, and once you have that configured, you can then begin monitoring and seeing this kind of data, application types and attributes. You can see the container status, if a container is up or down, the memory that's running in each container, and then you'll be able to act on when resources become overloaded. Here's an example of how the inventory looks. So you have your Docker host and then several containers in a hierarchy. You can expand each of the individual containers and then see what's being measured in terms of memory, network input, output, processor monitor types, and so on. Great feature about this is you know you have your Docker infrastructure environment and you've got it documented somewhere, but this automatically documents it for you. So once you have that connection, here we can see the Docker host configuration data in a particular table, so you can quickly access those configuration settings when you need to. Here are the dashlets that you can create. So a TrueSight Operations Manager provides a unique ability to you know, quickly create a dashlet that has a time series data of the measurement using the easy to use wizard. And then once you have a dashlet, you can associate it with different dashboards. So in this case, uh, we've created a dashboard that shows the typical Docker container measurements. And, and then if you think about it, you can then associate that with maybe another um, environment that's closely related to your Docker environment, which could, could be just your Linux underlying operating system and how that's going. So then you can see both on the same dashboard. Here's an example of in a Linux environment, you could have uh, several Docker daemon processes running. And here you can see that we're monitoring the these host resources here, but then we can also drill into the actual Docker host and Docker container environment. Monitoring with TrueSet Operations allows you to monitor up to 500 Docker containers per Docker host. And then here's our last slide, which is we support Docker versions 1.7 and above, as well as these popular uh, Linux platforms. So thank you very much for listening, and we hope to hear some great stories about you using your Docker environment to de deliver those apps uh, to your end users and be notified when something goes wrong before your end users even notice. Thanks.